Alan Santos getting ready to the hit. Alan Santos. Stay back. Hitter's got some good opposite field power. What I like about something being hit to the right side into the outfield is that the base runner at second has a very good read and can determine whether or not he can score on that base hit. Perez leads off second with one gone in the inning. Get your pitch and Let's go, big dog. Your spot. Foul ball. See how the catcher wanted that pitch up and in. Want to try to tie him up. That's the one thing we're seeing. That high fastball, you have to get it up there because of how hitters have changed their swings. The 0 2. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Say you win. Throw over to Prado, and they got him. Lead and the pitch. For the Naturals, the designated hitter, Tyler. In the air, out towards right center. Yes, Santos yeah. trots over to his left, and it's a one hopper off the wall. Should be extra bases. And he makes it to third, winning run aboard, and nobody out. Alan Santos, the next to hit. He was a strikeout victim his first time. Alan Santos. In there for strike one. The one. That one fouled off. And he deals. Swings and misses. And that is that. Top of the sixth inning. And now the center fielder, Alan Santos. March back to work. Misses off the plate. And that is ball one. We haven't seen a break in the weather, and the umpires might be forced to make a decision soon. Yeah, I think so, Boog. I mean, everyone looking and wondering when they're going to stop play. It definitely feels close. Prado makes the play, and there's one down. Here's the second baseman, Gabriel Cancel. Now Right-handed reliever. Baseman, Gabriel Cancel. Swing and a line drive and a base hit up the middle. Everything was on time and fluid in that swing. Got a pitch he could get the barrel on and lined it into center for the knock. Those always feel good. And here it comes. Santos leading things off and takes a strike. It's softly on the ground to third. Rivera picks it up. Leadoff man is out here in the eighth. And your final 4-2 for Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show. Thanks for stopping by. Now, Alan Santos. The center fielder. Alan Santos. Swings through that one. 0 oh and 1. Looks like he went up there guessing on the first pitch and was going to sell out to it. Didn't make any contact, though. No score just getting started, top of the first. The next pitch misses. Now 1 and 2. Next one in the dirt. The punch out there, and good work there as he gets a one, two, three. So one out, nobody on. And now Nick Prado. Batting second, the first baseman, Nick 
puts it in the air out towards left center. Makes the grab, and there's two gone. Now it's the second baseman, Gabriel Cancel. Batting none. And a pitch. The second baseman, Gabriel. Cancel. He swings and hits a fly ball, center field. Santos settles under it and makes the catch. And there's two away. And the batter now, Alan Santos. Now batter, the center field, <laughs> Alan Santos. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Come on, big dog, get your pitch. Jack Swing went around. That's strike one. One down, base is empty. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Two gone. Well, that's always the key. Back here at the ballpark. Bottom of the fourth. Here's Nick Prado. For the Naturals. Kicks and fires. Baseman, Nick. In the air out to center. And it's caught for the out. Welcome back. Bottom of the inning. Here's the center fielder, Jacoby Jones. For the Naturals. The center fielder. Jacoby. And that one is lifted in the air. Jones. Santos settles underneath it. One up, one down. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like. within the Runner at first, with two away. And now the center fielder, Alan Santos. Bolanos checks over to first, and he's back. And a foul ball. See it drive it like you can. Here you go. Owen oh, two as he waves at that one. Most guy on the mound understands that this batter is trying to take him deep. I think the key here is change speeds. Keep him off balance. Swing and a miss. And he is down on strikes for the third straight. Man at first. Here's the center fielder, Alan now Santos. The center fielder, Alan Santos. Next pitch downstairs, and that's ball one. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. And the 1 0. They say you win. Kicks and deals. And meanwhile, that pitch is off the catcher's mitt. It squirts away. The one, two. And another ball. Hitter's got some good opposite field power. What I like about something being hit to the right side into the outfield is that the base runner at second has a very good read and can determine whether or not he can score on that base hit. And a pitch. And down on strikes. And one away. A 4 nothing shutout in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, and now the center fielder, Alan Santos. 0 for 4 in the win last night. First pitch, and he just misses. No score, just getting started top of the first. And a big swing and a miss. Come on now, one time, right here. Strike two. So far, all we've seen in this at bat are fastballs. Look for him to slow it down right here ahead in the count. Next offering is fouled back. Righty to the plate. And he chases that one. And that'll do it. End of a play. Here's the center fielder, Alan Santos. The batter. The center fielder, Alan. Center. 
And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Next offering is in for a strike. Two strikes to a guy who's already 0 for 1 with the punch out. The only guy in the lineup with that strikeout. But you can't. a swing and a miss. That retires the side. And that'll do it. And welcome back. Leading off, Emmanuel Rivera. Leading off for Northwest Arkansas. Is your one. The third baseman, Emmanuel. Center field, Rivera. Santos racing over to make the catch. Pretty good job on the mound in this one, Singy. It feels like. And now the shortstop, Angelo Castellano. Now batter. The shortstop, Angelo. Out there to center. Castellano. Santos settles under this one. Makes the grab, and that'll end the inning. So they've been helpless through five. Pitching change here, number 39. 25th appearance of the year for him. So at this point of the ball game, we're talking about middle innings, and he need a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. Next offering is foul back. Stays alive. There you go, left line. And down on strikes he goes. One gone here. Oh, tough night at the Alan Santos will hit next. The right center Keep it going. Alan Santos. Next oh, offering right is down low. One and oh. In the dirt, but kept close. Deluzio on its second with two down. Next pitch is outside. And he walked him. That just came apart right there. Four pitch walk, and the guy at the play was not going to help him out by swinging at something out of the zone. The 3 2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Base is full, two gone. And here's the catcher, Ali Sanchez. And now the lefty. Swing and a miss, and that is that. So they low. But lead. And the final score here 4 3. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew, I'm John Shunt. And now, Alan Santos. The center fielder. Alan. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at one. That fastball at the bottom of the zone can be very effective. Just got to keep it on the corners. Next offering is in for a strike. Next one misses. Now one and two. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Pitch misses there. Two and two. Come on, guys. Get your pitch up there. In the air, left side. Hicklin drops steps, heads back on it. And makes the play, and that's out number three. So digging in, Gabriel Cancel. Batting second. The second baseman. Gabriel. And now the Cancel. one. This to center field, Santos. As this one sized up, puts it away for the out. And now the center fielder, Alan Santos. Now that the center fielder, Alan. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Counts one and oh. Next offering is in for a strike. late on that fastball well, he just threw that fastball by him elevated and if you're not looking up in that location very difficult to catch up to especially with that velocity next offering is foul back well pretty clear to me he was trying to go deep right there but you got to get a pitch that you can handle on the ground throw over to Prado out number three 
Back here at the ballpark, we head to the bottom of the fifth. Stepping in, Angelo Castellano. The Naturals, the shortstop. Now a fly ball to right center. Santos on the move to his left. Racing makes the catch. And a quick out number one. And now Alan Santos. Now batting the center fielder, Alan. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. It really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. The tying run at the plate. The count is one and two. See it, drive it. Let's go. Right here. Got him. So he's gotten deep into this game. So up next, Gabriel Cancel. Now and the pitch. Second baseman, Gabriel. Cancel. That's towards center. He's got it. There's two away. And your final score here today, 2-1. For Chris Singleton our and our entire outs, Santos. At in third, the center fielder, Allen Santos. First offering, misses the mark. Good luck, good luck, huh? And there's the strike. One and one. One time, right now, kid. Here we go. They say you win. One ball, two strikes. Drive that pitch, huh? Next offering is in the dirt. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. End of a half inning. Batting fifth. The first baseman, Nick. Swing and a ball lifted to center field. Santos makes the catch, and that'll do it. And now the center fielder, Alan Santos. Now so clutch, you could argue field. that he's been Alan. this team's MVP this year. Center. Pitch misses inside, ball one. He's looking for a ground ball to get a double play and out of this jam. Next pitch misses, and the count is 2-0. and oh. The next offering misses, 3-0. and oh. Hitter's got some good opposite field power. What I like about something being hit to the right side into the outfield is that the base runner at second has a very good read and can determine whether or not he can score on that base hit. Rolled over to third. Off balance feed. There's one. What a double play that was. Inning over. Here we go, guys. Ready to go. Bottom four. And the batter now, number 15. Leading off for Northwest Arkansas. The right Into field. center. Number 15. Calls it in, and there's one away. Here's the center fielder, Alan Santos. Now batting the center fielder, Allen Santa. And it's fouled away. The pitch. Perez at second with two down. Got him looking. Good job of damage control right there. A run on two. Welcome back. Ready to go for the last half of the Leading inning. And now the first North baseman, North Nick Prado. The first baseman. Out to Nick. center. Santos oh. on the move. Drops into the glove. One down. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every at bat. Base is empty, one away. And now the right fielder, number 15. And that one in the air, center field. And there's two down. 
Pretty good job on the mound in this one, Siggy. It feels like we've seen a lot of. So digging in, Alan Santos. Now that, the center fielder, Alan Santos. That one's in there, 0 and 1. Yo one. Foul ball there. Here comes a pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. And the 2 And a foul ball. The 2 Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. Two down. Well, they've had a great plan of attack. And welcome back. All set for the start of the inning. And here is Alan Santos. Hey, right guy, no one better up there. Santos. In there, and it's 0-1. Activity in the bullpen. A left-hander appears to be getting ready. Comes up empty on the swing, 0-2 now. He's had a tough day at the plate. Three strikeouts already. It's hard not to think negative, but you got to find a way to somehow center up the baseball and put it in play. Oh, right to the backstop. Pitch and fouled off. Hey, no one better. He's right here. Looking good. Man, it's Nobody second. Swing and a miss, and he's down on strikes. A 3 2 final score in this one. A one run extra inning win for Chris Singleton and our entire Santos. That is third. The center fielder, Alan Santa. In there for strike one. Deluzio over at first with one away. Pickoff throw. Deluzio back in on a dive. And a foul ball. pitch swing and a miss struck him out and now two gone Boog gets talked about a lot now the catcher up to hit Freddie for me for me swinging it much better this Freddie. season in away games and here at home Freddie. lifted in the air right center field Santos turns moving to his left racing makes the catch runner tags at second and he moves up to third now two away Next to hit, Alan Santos. He's 0 for 1. Pickoff move to first, Alan. and he's back safely. Santa. Nice warm day here, good baseball weather. Does that change anything, Chris, especially for the hitters? Absolutely. You feel so much more comfortable at the plate. You're not worried about you know, getting jammed on fastballs oh, inside down. part of the plate. Uh, you can kind of be more selective instead of just looking out away so that you can get the barrel to it in that part and get on the inside part of the plate as well. Hey, come on, big dog. Get pitch. Next offering misses. Hey, yeah, the count one and two. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Hey, get your pitch up there. And the righty deals. That's a ball. And it's even up. Come on, baby. See it. Drive it. Let's go. Next one just misses. And that's ball three. The right-hander gives up the two-out walk. Not nah, what he wanted to do there, Boo. That keeps this inning alive and gives this offense a good chance to cut into their deficit. T 
tapped in front of the play. Throw over to Prado, and that is that. Now it's Jacoby Jones. Now batting, center fielder, Jacoby Jones. Out towards right center field, Santos on the move to his left. Makes the grab, and that's the inning. Back here at the ballpark, here's the shortstop at the play. Lino Angelo Castellano. West Arkansas. The shortstop, Angelo Castellano. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. Santos under it, and makes the grab. And there's one away. So two down. Here's the center fielder, Alan now Santos. The center fielder. Allen. I say you went. Oh, and one. Wait for your pitch up there, huh? Next one misses nice at nice one lead. and one. Swing and a miss. That is strike two. Hey, your pitch, drive it deep, huh? Here you go. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. Now, here is Alan Santos. Hey, now batting, the center fielder, Alan. Swings through that one, 0-1. Oh Clearly all in on the fastball right there, but it was a changeup. Bottom just fell out of it. He's going to have to make an adjustment. Next offering is in for a strike. Hey, let it fly, let it fly right here. And a swing and a miss, and there's two away. Third time he struck out. So up next, Nick Prado. He's already homered here in this one. The first baseman, Nick Prado. In the air, out towards right center. Great effort as he's able to haul it in. Tags up from second, and he'll head to third. And he's up to third safely with two gone. So two away with nobody on. And now the center fielder, Alan the batter, Santos. The center fielder, Alan Santos. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Not looking like they'll be adding any insurance runs heading to the bottom of the ninth, so it's going to be on the bullpen to hold this lead. The 0 1. Check swing. He went. And it's nothing in two. Pitch. One ball, two strikes now. And now the count is even. See it ripping up there. That one misses, and the count is filled up. At this point in the game, you cannot issue free passes. He's going to have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way, gone. That'll fire up the dugout. Home run number 30 on the year. It's 5-3. Chris, that ball came out hot. So let's see what StatCast has to say. Yeah, it really did, Boog. hundred and all. Here's the third baseman, Emmanuel Rivera. Now batting, the third baseman, Emmanuel. The tying run at the plate. Rivera. Line to right, and this one could be extra bases. Around third. He'll score easily, and they trail by one. In there safely. Well, back with it. For so many players from Latin American countries in particular who sign as international free agents or even through the draft, their transition to affiliated professional baseball can not just be a shift in terms of the game itself, but it can also come with a good amount of culture shock. I have minor league manager Rachel Balkovec with me. Rachel, what is that transition like for these players? You know, it's really inspiring and it's, it's incredible to think um, 
how much they have to go through. And I think, you know, the casual fan doesn't understand there's an incredible journey that the Latin players go through. Um, and I've been fortunate enough to work at the lower levels a, a lot of my career for, for the past 10 years. And for me personally, I've learned so much. I've learned more from the Latin American players than I have from our American players, mm -hmm. to be honest with you. They've they've taught me so much about being vulnerable and, and learning a different language and, and how they're able to really assimilate and, and learn about our culture. It makes inspires me and it should inspire other people also to learn about their culture and, and really embrace their culture in the game. Late in the season and holding a comfortable division lead, a young team. So we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content, and if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95. You'll have a great day and peace out.